Hello everyone and welcome to another StarCraft 2 livecast. Excuse me, playing and commentating live here on the... <clears throat> wow, my voice is all crackly. On the Korean server. And it looks like we have a Zerg opponent here on Habitation Station. Serra V. Not enough minerals. So I've just started on Korea, I got placed in gold, and my last eight matches have been against four Master minerals. League opponents and four Diamond League opponents. So minerals. I think my Not MMR is on minerals. the verge of getting Not enough minerals. Um, upgraded to Diamond. But I've only played maybe 12 games on Korea in total, so we'll see. Not enough minerals. Right. Not enough minerals. Huh. Okay. Not enough minerals. Ah, you scared me. Not enough minerals. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen SCVs. That's what we want queued up. SCV so that's perfect. Ready. Thirteen and nineteen. We are queuing our next SCV over to the gold. I actually like to keep that depot up. It creates us a slight bit of delay because I actually want a bit of delay here. SCV ready. What's going on? I'm gonna chase that guy Why around. Here and we'll create the next two. Go ahead. Put wall off. Boom. Not enough minerals. Boom. We hear you. Not enough and then minerals. two more SCVs. One. Not enough minerals. A little bit behind the minerals from chasing that drone around. Not enough minerals. But close enough. One, two. Okay. Huh? Bad news. Additional supply depots required. That off. We're gonna turn this into a planetary. I'll land. Marine. <clears throat> and orbital when this finishes. What's going on? Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. And finally, second marine. Not enough minerals. <clears throat> Not sure what's going on with my voice. May have commentated too many games here. Second marine. Base is under attack. Upgrade complete. Ah, you scared me. Yeah, yeah. SCV ready. All right, so I already made a bunch of links. Guess we'll see how this turns out, anyways. I think I saw six. That sucks. That's a lot more than six. Base so I don't think we lost attack. much in the way of SCVs. But we lost our Marines. And this is hurting a little bit. Well. 
new supply depots required. You want a piece of me, boy? Cute. Look for Nidus with one of these. Planetary. down just in case we all in want them on the low ground now we can start taking our gases job, huh? SCV ready. add on complete upgrade complete Turret ring. So we haven't seen any gas expenditure as of yet. How can they push their way through like that? That's such bullshit. Required for place upgrade complete. My siege tank is dead, right? Nope, and end up over here. Oh, up. Completely SCV random place. Ready. Additional supply depots required. SCV ready. That's fine. Additional SCV supply ready. depots required. Ah, uh, I can't believe they pushed through. Bad news. Maybe I have to hold position and says stop. Oh, the supply cap is killing me. Big job, huh? Not enough minerals. Not enough ah, minerals. SCV ready. Finish the upgrades. Oh. Additional supply depots. Not enough minerals. Ah, you scared me. I can't build here. SCV ready. Bad Not news. enough minerals. Complete. Loud and clear. 
think that'll be GG. Supply depots required. Ah, you scared me. Uh -huh. Okay. Ready. Add on complete. Why do I have no minerals? And so much gas. It's weird. So let's leave a sparse amount of auto turrets because he went swarm post, so it's gonna be super immobile. Are under attack. Upgrade 
Base is under attack. Base additional is under attack. Additional support is required. Target ready. Target ready. This battle requires additional. That's some fails. It's a pretty heavy pressure. I dealt with it okay. Um, luckily, I transitioned Swarm Host off of uh, being behind. Which made that a lot easier of a counterattack. My production was quite late. I was up to like 2200 gas and I still hadn't um, even started my Raven production, which is a, too much of a gas bank. And I guess like everything just was putting me behind, except I was still mining max as much gas as I normally do. So I probably should have adjusted for that somehow. Maybe seven starports and two factories or something, rather than six and three. That first bus was actually really scary. He almost made it through. I mean, he did make it through, but just with two roaches, I guess. So that... It's gotta be a whole position. Like, there, these SCVs are stopped. Right? But they're not in whole position. Maybe they have to be in whole position. Yeah, they're on stop, not hold position. So he's actually able to just push them out of the way. So he just pushes that one out of the way. I did not move that SCV, that one just went on its own. Now, I've had this happen before, it must be the stop versus hold position thing. Luckily just two roach. Not mining the minerals here too, that actually Slow down my production a lot. I mean, I still have my all my SCVs mining and efficiently, but you know, gold minerals spare than blue. So here he gears up for a big attack on my fourth. And I decide to focus fire. I don't focus fire the siege tank, which is one thing you could do, although it only shoots out so far, so it's not often we'll get into it. I also didn't set my SCVs to, to repair. Sometimes you can just stop them, throw them on auto repair really quickly. Although they'd probably be repairing each other, first of all. Um, but what I did do is focus the bailings, and I got pretty lucky here. So at first I focused this pack right there. So we got um Two roaches, so eight bailings in there. Got them all but two. And then the rest of the bailings, I got stuck behind roaches here, so it actually bought me time to shoot those bailings. So those bailings are all down to seven, and I think I even got one more shot on these three. Oh yeah, I shot one of them. So one, two, three, looks like four bailings are going to connect. But all these roaches are doing a lot of damage, so... Um, I dropped to about 70 hit points there on my planetary. And Newton's lost now 6,000 to 1,400. Um, I'm on four base economy, and he's on three, just taking his fourth. Fourth and fifth, I should say. I really wanted to snipe that bailing. I almost suicided my my badge to do so, and I'm like, oh, that's probably not worth it. 
But said I should have decided later into a sport crawler, so all's fair. Probably should have set my bench out with the initial Hellbat push. I think that would have been the best use of it. So then even if it runs into a queen, I mean, at least I was fighting with the Hellbats. So here comes the Stormhost transition. But remember he's lost a lot of units and he's trying to establish an economy and then he gets a lot of swarm hosts. That means there can't be that much support for it. And in fact there isn't. He has four roaches, three bailings, and that's it. So when I see swarm hosts, I usually go a lot lighter on the counterattack. And by lighter I mean I put just a sparse amount of auto turrets in many bases rather than a lot of auto turrets in a few bases. to be careful in a spot like this when you set this on hold position auto repair is as soon as this planetary finishes it's going to be the same threat priority as the other planetary and it's a closer target so for the good chance all these locusts are going to start shooting this pf and if these guys are on hold position auto repair they're not going to be in position to keep that alive yeah and that's exactly what's happening one SCV was on hold position, so I'm repairing with one SCV, but it's not much. A couple more waves, not would have been down. Uncle fail. And boom. <laughs> Still got a lot of tech structures left. Looks like Swarm is the only thing he can't. No, he's got all his tech still. Not the hive, but spire, spawning pool, roach warren, bailing nest, infestation pit. It's pretty much set. Twelve roaches. Um, in a moment, he's going to lose one more. So it'll be 11 roaches. No economy. Still a six swarm host somewhere. And then he's going to lose this base, which will put him on two bases. One, two. So yeah. Not looking good against my four base economy. Five base. Five base economy. I think the game was decided on this bust here, the one that went into my main. I had my barracks lifted, so he actually didn't have to smash through this. He put a couple bailings into it anyways, but um, yeah, 16 bailings, you know, that would get definitely get through my front wall, but it probably wouldn't have gotten through my bunker, and then I would have still had this wrap in the planetary. Instead, he gets through the wrap. Try to plug the hole here, get a little bit careful, I don't want to plug it against uh, bailings, but the bailings blow, then I... See right there, it's like, yeah, everything's trapped. If they're just on hold position, these these roaches would be stuck in range of the planetary. But able to just kind of shimmy their way through. <laughs> My random siege tank placement. I was trying to get it over here to deal with these roaches. It never made it that far. Base produced hit points really quickly, so it so it took all the bailings for him to get back in there. And I think at this point it was basically GG. Um, 
worker count is actually somewhat similar right now, but he's just establishing his third where I got four bases. I can build four SCVs at a time. Units lost as well in my favor. And a worker lead and mules. He is kind of do or die from there. And I think that's the way you have to all in against this build. If you take out this expo with null in or take out this expo with null in, you're still behind. But if you crash through my natural and able to take out my main base, then the game's basically over. Anyways, with that, we'll call it the end of this video, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Hit that subscribe button and check the description for a thumbs up link. Goodbye.